Today we're going to do a how-to on how to utilize the merchandise and stuff from our store, Spiritually Sci-Fi, which is www.spirituallysci-fi.com where you can get merch, spell candles, sage, and so much more spiritual needs. Um, so today I'm going to start off with one of the inventories, which is the white candle. I'll open it up for you. As you see, it's non-scented. It's a jar of candle. We definitely have different candles coming as well that we'll be making um, that you can utilize for your spells and so on and so forth. So, a white candle is definitely more like a universal candle. You can utilize this candle for all different types of spells. Um, it's not necessarily just based on one type of spell, but one type of color type of candle. Um, so, when you are let's say doing a, a, a manifestation spell or or any of those type of spells and stuff like that, you'll make sure to get your candle, you know, you'll have your dressings of the items that you need, put it around the candle. Let's say we can use this bowl and then the candle can go in the middle of the bowl and you can just dress the, um, around the candle. You can put your oils if it's a blessing type of um, spell, white prosperity, a wealth type of spell, different things and stuff like that. Normally people use uh, brown or green for those type of things as well. But if you want to use this, you can use this as well because, like I said, this is a universal candle, so it's definitely more of more of your intent. You put the intent on the candle, and everything else just takes hold from there. And now we're gonna move forward. And we're going to go to a black protection spell candle. So with this, and I, again, these are retailed on our website for $6 plus shipping and handling. So we have jar candles and stuff like that. 100% made by us as well. Um, and like I said, we'll have other candles coming in as well for the inventory. But again, same thing with this. This is more of this is a protection spell. So let's say you are having an experience where... You're giving some bad juju or you're dealing with a lot of different energies at your workplace or your home place or so on and so forth. Or you're someone that live alone, but you typically occasionally have some company every now and then. And every every now and then when someone does come over, you have some type of weird experience happening, money going missing, things not falling through, or whatever the situation is. A lot of attachments of energies happen from us transcribing that type of energy with other people, touching people, being in the same space as people, living with people, so on and so forth. So what you want to do, you want to get one of our black protection spell candles. Um, this is definitely just protect your aura, your energy, and keeps things purified. Um, so what you want to do is let's say hypothetically, I'm not gonna go through a full one, but hypothetically, you'll have your dressing bowl, you'll have your candle, you put the candle in it. Um, you say the things you want over it. You know, I want protection. I want, I want good energy. I want to remove all negative bad things. I want to intent this candle with nothing but that type of energy. You'll light it, let it light for the whole day, or the whole night, or whenever you did until it burns all out. Um, just to seal that spell. But these are definitely good to use. They're pretty, very deep, rich black. You don't really see that much. I know in previous uh, stores that I've been in, I've always got black candles, but when you chip it off, it kind of looks bluish, a bluish undertone. This one is 100% pure black. And this is our protection um, spell candle. And this retail for $6 plus shipping and handling. <clears throat> now we have a green candle. I say you can use this for prosperity, wealth, um, different things and stuff like that. I would say, like hypothetically, I'm going to use it for prosperity. So I'll, you know, have the candle. You can have your dressing bowl. You don't always have to have a dressing bowl. If you prefer to have a plate, dressing bowl, etc., go put your candle in it. You know, say your intentions over it. Manifest that reality that you want. Manifest those goals coming through. Manifest those um, blockages of success and so on and so forth. And you'll put the tent on it and stuff like that. If you have a spell, cast a spell, you know, go th through the spell ingredients and stuff like that. Um, if you have um, prosperity oils or anything like that, which we, we definitely want to um, have available soon in our store, um, you can dress the candle with that. You know, light the candle. 
let it sit, let it do its thing and stuff like that. Um, again, this is good definitely for prosperity, green, money, attracting, you know, likeness. I definitely would utilize this when I, I would say what we did is the beginning of this month, um, we used it in the beginning of the month and it actually worked as far as that prosperity spell. It brought in a lot of different um, incomes and um, business opportunities and so on and so forth. So this definitely does work. Um, so light and prosperity spells and, and brown um, candles as well, just to give the month a mood, a direction. That is definitely something I would utilize and something I would do. Again, this is retail at $6 plus shipping and handling. And these are non-scented by the way. And these are the jar candles. Like I said, we have more inventory coming with different candles, different shapes, different sizes, and so on and so forth. So always check back with us. So then we have the love candle. You know, love spell. And the love spell doesn't always have to just be uh, for romance. It could be for self-care, self-love. You want to like open those chakras in you to love yourself more, see yourself uh, more in different divisions of life and so on and so forth. Um, so what you can do with our spiritual seven-day bath book, you can actually use this candle in one of the baths. I think it's the purpose bath or the heart chakra bath, I believe. I think it's a heart chakra bath. Um, what you do, you dress your dress the water with all the things that is needed for the spiritual bath. You know, go put it on the side of the, the uh, tub or behind you or however your bathroom is designed. Put your tent over it. If you want to put some oils, put some oils on it, prosperity, so on and so forth. Stuff that's going to invoke that, that self-love that you probably haven't had in a while. That thing that you've been missing and that you would like to have in your life. And, you know, I'll say it over and, you know, I just want to invoke just uh, self-love and, and loving of self in every aspect of my life and so on and so forth. And put that intent in here, put that energy in here, charge it up, light it up, and let everything does what we got to do. You know, some ought to be. And these are the love spell candles. So again, you do, it doesn't always have to be romantic love and stuff like that. You probably want to charge yourself up with love for yourself or for a family member or so on and so forth. So there's nothing wrong with a little bit of love in your life. I always say that. And these are retail at $6 plus shipping to hand on our website, spirituallysci-fi.com. Um, so I'm going to move over into... I know a lot of times people have hard times purifying and um, just saging and getting your home together, stuff like that. So this is, let me check our set. So this is, so White Wolf Sage, this is four inches. These retail on our site for $7. Um, very thick, you can use a, a, good, a good amount of times. Um, very beautiful as well. Smells very good. I love the way sage smells. Um, so let's say this will be my little spiritual bowl. I feel like every spiritual person should have a bowl that you use to conduct your purifying and your saging and your removing of energy and stuff like that. Negative energy, I should say. Um, so I will light the sage. Put it in the middle. Walk it around the home. You know, I want to remove all negative energy. And, you know, I want to center all good energy. I want to remove any blockages on my spirit or anything that I don't see. You know, I want to just make sure I'm just going through the home. Even if some, some people get uh, the, the uh, feathers and, and just dose the energy into the air. You know, stuff like that, the smoke. So you just want to make sure that when you're doing it, you're going through the home here saging and you're doing what you got to do and stuff like that if it's if you don't want to hold the stick because you could hold the stick and walk through the house as well if you don't want to hold a stick put it in a bowl have a bowl that's just dead destined for spiritual um needs and uses just only nothing that you're going to be eating with and stuff like that you want to keep everything in its own category but again this is of the white wolf sage four inches we do have more bigger ones coming as well in different sizes and stuff like that. Um, and this is retail at $7 plus shipping the handle. You know, just like that. 
Removing all negative energy. Remove all negative comments. Um, so we move forward. So, um, the good thing about our conscious and subconscious is that when we learn how to utilize it, and, and when I say utilize it, utilize it in its best resources, we then know how to feed it its offerings. Everything has its offerings. The universe, the sun, the moon, everything has its offerings, its offerings and its recharges that it needs and stuff like that. So what I want to do, this is not one of our items, by the way, but we will definitely have journals and stuff like that as well. I just, we just happen to get this. Um, but what I would do is say like, hey, I want to manifest some money in my life. Or I want to manifest just healthy relationship with money. So, you know, you'll take your pen and stuff like that and you'll go, you're right, I am rich. And write it about like maybe like six times. I ain't gonna do six times, but hypothetically I'll say I did six times. I am rich. I am rich. And you wanna say it, this is an affirmation that you wanna say until it becomes your natural dialogue. It's your natural vocabulary. It's your natural thing. So you wanna write, I am rich, I am rich, I am rich, I am rich. I am wealthy, I am prosperous, I am, you know, anything that you want to be, you write it as you already are, and you will become it. So, I wrote that down, I am rich, I am rich, I am rich, I am rich. So, along with this, for the subconscious, you put symbolization up. Symbolization will help the subconscious read um, alert and receive and then give out exactly what you what you desire from it. Um, we put these through our house. We put it in random places, egg, uh, Easter egg hunt type style, whatever you want to do. This actually helps bring in things that you want. Um, and you can do a lot of symbolization. I know a lot of people use a lot of um, different magic methods and stuff like that to bring and manifest things that they want in life. Um, so I'm always here for just doing things that's going to promote and, and increase and, and be of resource to whatever you are seeking in your life. Um, so hang it over your, your, your bathroom shower or tub or toilet or doors or whatever the situation is. Put it all throughout your house and it's allowed the sub, subconscious mind to conceive, alert, and retrieve and then release that energy into your life. And I'm pretty sure sooner or later you'll definitely start seeing money and things flowing in different ways and different accounts. So that's one how to or how to manifest wealth or different things. And there's different deeper context that we can do that I will do in a more deep context video very soon. Um, but definitely putting that in your face, putting that energy out there, you will receive what you, you know, you will reap what you sow, as they always say. That's definitely some good manifestation. So we do have a lot of um, different spiritual spices and stuff like that um, in the store. We have sea salt, which is good to go with the black protection spell candle. Um, so, you know, you can have uh, your, let's say you have your plate and stuff like that and you put the little the sea salt around and stuff like that you put the protection circle around it so on and so forth so these are definitely always good to utilize this is retail for three dollars plus shipping and handling on our website beautiful packaging and it's really really good I, we use it a lot in spells um, but you can use it as spells. This is also something that you can utilize when you're doing your cleansing and uh, spiritual, your spiritual cleansing of your home and stuff like that. Putting it in your corners. Um, just put it in places like egg hunt style. Things that the cracks of your windows and so on and so forth. It gets rid of a lot of that negative energy and it blocks out negative energy spirits and so on and so forth from coming through into your home. And again, this is a retail for $3 plus shipping and handling. 
This is another one. So, and, and this is actually handmade by us. Handmade, crushed, and all that processed through us. Just like the candles as well. The candles and wax is all made by us as well. Um, so a lot of our stuff is definitely with great intent and energy that is needed for witches, baby witches, and so on and so forth to have your spiritual journey be assisted by us. Um, so this is Casaria, and this is really good again as well for protection. Um, you can, again, have your candle, your black protective candle, dress it with this, walk this to your house, put it in corners of your house. Allow it to be around with the sage and so on and so forth. These things are very, very good for protection. And just like I said, warding off evil spirits, negative attachments and so on and so forth. Just like as well, um, our spiritual bath book as well. Um, that's something that we can utilize as well. And I would definitely want to show y'all how that looks too. If you haven't seen the picture of it. So... You can even do a little package with yourself. So, so you can do it. You can even do a little package with yourself. So this is the seven day bath book, revoking negative energy, centering self, invoking. Uh, spiritual powers in a guide to achieving higher self as written by me and my partner definitely a very good book to utilize it's a handbook style so it's not like a book that you gotta read and stuff like that but it's it's handbook style there also it has for all the baths because it's a seven day bath book so every day has a designated bath that you'll utilize. This bath is a bath of gratitude um, and it says the intent intent the water make the bath water Warm or hot, um, take a piece of paper and write down 10 things you're grateful for, clear your mind, half a cup of Florida water, half a cup of rose petals. So definitely in our shop, we'll have a lot of those things that you could buy and get the ingredients for to pair with your books. But if you want to pair, you can pair all the candles with it. All the candles can be utilized with this book. And even the sage, Casaria. Uh, salt, spell salt, you know, so all this stuff can be utilized with this because it all has these ingredients in here. Um, but like I said, you can get a lot of your ingredients for your spell, um, for the seven day bath books from us. Um, this retails for $20 plus shipping and handling. And we have had a lot of customers already talk about their experiences and how they feel recharged and removed and centered and so on and so forth. So we intended this book with that energy. We intended our product with that energy as well, um, depending on which product it is for its own sole purposes. And we definitely just invite you on to the store and we can't wait to have you buy and purchase things and utilize it for your um, spiritual practices and let us know exactly how it's working out for you. All right. This is your boy, Seven Taylor, and I am signing out. Bye.